Hi, I'm Michael Lai with Asian Feed. It's great to be with both of you today. Hi. Hi, Michael. And just starting off, this is the final season. How did each of you prepare to say goodbye to your characters? Mm. I don't think I ever did uh, consciously prepare to say goodbye because that would be too difficult, to be honest. Um, I think, you know, we were just so focused on telling the best story that we could, and that was very easy for us because the writing was already so, so incredible. Um, so really, it was just focusing on doing a good job and doing the best that we could. Um, I, I, yeah, I, I don't, I still haven't honestly said goodbye. I don't think I ever will. I, I feel like Kamala still lives inside of me very much. I'm, she's a lot like me and I'm a lot like her and I feel like I've grown along with her growing throughout the series. And uh, even the other characters, I personally, as a fan of the show, I will continue to keep watching it whenever I need, um, whenever I need the show, I'm just gonna watch it. And everybody can, that's the beautiful thing about Netflix. Absolutely. And on a similar note, what do each of you think you'll miss most about the show? I mean, I obviously miss the, um, I'll, I'll miss the diversity. I got to tell you, I, I don't, I, it's, I can't imagine being on another set that's so rigorously diverse as this one, mm -hmm. like behind the camera, in front of the camera, every direct, the writer, every uh, the ecosystem of the show, everything connected to it is 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 diverse. Yeah, and that means different points of view, and that means an invitation to bring your full self to set uh, or the writer's room every day. Um, I'll miss that, but I really I think the way the show landed and the and the feedback we get and the way that it's changed people's lives and the the mothers and daughters watching it together, mm -hmm. like all the viewing of the consumption of the show is. A delight. It is such a delight. Right, and like you just kind of touched upon, as we look back on the four seasons of the show, I think it's amazing just to see how many people this show has touched around the world. Mm -hmm. What about it do you think made it so special? I think what it is, is it's such a specific family and the things that they're going through in their own individual and collective journeys is so specific to them, but it's it's also so universal, and I think, you know, just the story, the, you know, we talk about this a lot. I think that the reason this show has landed so well and, and resonated with so many people for different reasons is because really the writing comes from such a place of truth. You know, we have such an amazing writer's room of talented and, and, and creative people, you know, starting with Mindy and Lang, but so many of the storylines come from their own personal, real-life, lived experiences, and that's, you know, it's, it's that truth that has translated into uh, the story that we've told and, and, and why it's been so impactful. I think if you don't write from a place of truth, I, I, don't, I, I don't think that it could have ever been as successful if it hadn't come from that place. And it's also like exploring something, as, as Richard used the word universal, but it's also primal. Like it's a coming of age story mixed with, mixed with understanding a parent or a child in, in a deeper, more meaningful way. It's just these, these things that everyone, no matter where you come from, goes through. Yeah. And a fierce family love. And what I love about the show is no matter who you are and where you come from, you can find yourself in the show somehow. And it's very rare to have a yeah. show like that. You know, it, it just kind of has an ability to embrace uh, the viewer because it has yeah. so many diverse points of view. Diverse points of view, but it's also without spoon feeding anything there's no need to contextualize anything with the culture especially yeah i don't feel like we ever had to explain why were we eating with our hand we just did that because that is who we are and yeah. and the contradictions like yeah. it, the show begins with davy praying to god and ends with her praying to god yeah and she's yeah. asking for real things but she's also asking for like a bigger button more boobs do you know what i mean or like a hot guy or you know the 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 beautiful contradictions that come in our our, our culture the the way it really is is portrayed without any apologies mm. oh, and no footnotes. No footnotes. That's that's a good little hashtag right mm. there. <laughs> Absolutely. Thank you both so much for your time. You. It was an absolute pleasure and I hope you have an amazing rest of your day. Thank you.